And I'd like to say a word on another subject matter. It is the subject with Ukraine. I understand that we have some kind of partnership with Ukraine. And we, for one reason or another, want to embrace Ukraine into the United Nations. I believe that is an accurate statement. I'm not positive, but I believe it is. The United States has been supporting Ukraine in its self-defense against this Russian tyrant, <clears throat> this evil Russia tyrant. I call one of the most evil forces on the face of the earth today. But he's not alone. He's just one of them. And it appears to me that uh, the support that the United States and probably the United Nations are giving Ukraine just is not sufficient enough. This other guy has all of this power and he's bulging it on Ukraine. It's making our help, even though we're saying we're helping, seems like nothing. Seems absolutely like nothing because Ukraine is being destroyed and all of the forces have been restricted to a certain limit that they could go to for Ukraine. And I say restricted because I'm sure they could go further. They would have, but they haven't. And so I say to all of the people who are supposed to be supporting Ukraine, I know many of you might say, well, that money can be spent better at home. There are so many reasons that that money would do good at home. And I'm sure it will. And I'm not going to try to take away from that because it would. But at the same time, the lack of funds being available to take care of that at home and to take care of what has got to be taken care of with Ukraine indicates that there's a power play a ploy that's missing. And that is my reason for standing before you, ladies and gentlemen, to tell you that as long as we're dealing with dictates of hearts of men and their selfishness, we will always have this. And if we want to seriously get rid of this, then we have to be serious about it with ourselves. We have to be honest with ourselves, honest with one another. We are our own protectors or we are our own destroyers. We got to get that to our head. So I just wanted to mention that there are those that will come to you and say, I can open up your eyes so you can see how to fly. And those in power will pay no attention to that. They've heard that lie before. They're, they've told it. They're the same. So to them, it's just another lie. They don't want to hear it. And you, my friends, just because you put your power in these voices, you tune out. And so the world misses. I just want to say that to you. And I'm going to cut that one out. <clears throat>